and all right let's just see time to charge your phone <laughs> okay actually where do what I So who do I want to bring next? Your phone won't charge while in use? Huh, weird. Preston, come here. I, come here, mother. Oh, God, fucking damn it. Stay sharp. Don't let your guard down. Uh, <clears throat> is there something you need? Come with me. I need your help. Sure thing, General. I think the folks here can manage on their own now. Thanks to you. Uh, send Ada to. Okay. Would you like me to go with you? Uh iPod. iBot pod scan for resources. I can make missile turrets if I want. Hey, Tobin. Fun fact, today is the 80th anniversary of the D-Day landing. Oh, shit. Alright. Well, first things first. Let's figure out what we can uh, get rid of. Automatic laser pistol. Charging sniper rifle. Mm. Compensated. Subtuned. Do I need two of them? I'll always keep a fat man. Uh, 
Oh yeah, it's gamma if I... Anything pipe is just basically getting tossed. Or, uh, is this where I start equipping my, uh, by the way, okay, this is actually a technical question. Is, uh, if I equip my settlers with guns, do they have infinite ammo? Like if I give them like laser pistols, do they just have infinite cells just for their baseline gun or like, it's just a technical question because I am not actually sure. Mr. Handy Buzz Blade. Speed very fast. Well, yeah, it's like a chainsaw. Vest and slacks. Oh. Oh, wait. Oh, hell no. Okay, that's charisma two. Apparently I can't scrap these. Ski man, did you uh catch my question?
No, sorry, playing Lords of the Fallen. What's up? Uh, when you uh, when you equip a settler with a new gun, uh, do they have infinite ammo for it? Like, if say I was yes. just give the this Minuteman. Hi. Can we get you a drink? No. Okay. Crap. General. Need to give them the ammo? Okay. I do not have the spare ammo for that stuff. I'm just curious, like, what I should sell and where I should sell it. And, like, what I should just get rid of. Like, I'm thinking all the pipe stuff. I could probably just get rid of. Boosted, agitated, improved automatic laser pistol. Jeez. I'm not going to get... I just finally am sorting out my goddamn inventory as, you know, as much as I've been trying. Because I keep getting more stuff because I'm an absolute little loot whore. What are you building? I also need to sell some stuff. Actually. Uh, stores, traders. Uh, armor. Okay, I need cap collector to get the bigger one. Gotta head to the store. So here's my thinking. I might, uh, do one of each store and just set them up along here. Up. Uh, okay. There we go. Okay. And, uh... <laughs> homeboy died. Let's 
So we're actually going to set up like a bunch of stores. Caravan network. Start with the trading stand. What's the difference? I need rank one in medic for a clinic. That works. In case you're wondering why I'm wanting so walking walking so slow, because I have a lot, a lot of just weapons. Eventually, I do want to. Reduce the damage from a damn. We're almost there. Down to 265 at least. Let's take a walk normally now. If you ain't been up to see Grey Garden, you should go. The whole place is run by robots. Command. Okay. You here. OK. 
Okay, I don't even know what this technically is. I'll take a look. Sure. Here's what I've got. Okay. Oh, jeez. Okay, we're slowly getting somewhere. Fine. Okay. Map. All right, let's head over to Starlight. And then we'll uh, finish up. Uh, or okay Jake. All right, build it up, please. Thank you. Nice choice. Let's get up some defenses. Now I'm sure you'll appreciate this, Paul. Raiders will have a hard time taking on someone with enough of these. Oh, and why is that? This plot will allow folks to set up proper defenses within the settlement. No more jury-rigged turrets and spotlights. Now we can have real watchtowers, guard posts, coordinated patrols, the whole shebang. It'll take folks with the correct skills to man them, but it'll be well worth the effort. So, no more raider attacks? 
Well, let's not give it too much credit. I'm sure some will still be dumb enough to try. But you should see a lot less attacks with a few of these. Hey, good to hear. Oh, it already wired it in. Perfect. Okay, just time this and all done. go and the last one oh should think twice before taking on a settlement with another of these things. It's all looking good so far. Let's keep going. Okay. Go. All right, Jake, do your thing. You should know people have been complaining a bit about the bed situation. Yes. Hmm. The bed situation? I don't like. Uh, furniture, beds. Yeah, I gotcha. To a brick and mortar store. Well, in this case, a scrap wood and corrugated steel store. Indeed. I apologize if you can hear that. And finished. Announcing another amazing breakthrough. Brought to you by Rocco. Rocco Brand ASAP Sensors can now allow your citizens the freedom to sell off excess assets without running afoul of Johnny Law. Rocco's automated auditing software ensures correct sales tax is always applied and collected. Never again need you or your citizens via a surprise visit from the taxman. Thanks to Rocco Brand ASAP Sensors. Do 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 do. Yeah, I think we're good. Nothing like a little commerce. All right. Everything seems to be going.
caravans, sharing supplies. Oh, municipal. Oh, well, so far, I'll admit, out of the tad word, this might not work. I mean, we are using the vault hub to run these new plot types. Okay. How's everything look from your point of view? Nothing seems out of place or incomplete, does it? Hmm. Why do you ask? This is the first time we're building these new plots, and we're using less than perfect hardware to do it. I just want to make sure nothing seems out of place or missing. Uh, seems fine to me. Ah, good to hear. What about you, old Paul? See anything that don't look right? All looks good to me. But didn't you say you had four plots to show me? I'm only counting three. Or are my cataracts playing up again? No, you're right. We only put down three so far. But the last plot requires a little more explanation. Hmm. So if you're ready, should we get on with it? Yeah, sure. Sure, let's do it. All right, last but not least, we have the municipal plot. Go ahead and put down an ASAM for that. All right, municipal plot, you say? I've got plenty of ASAM sensors, thankfully. We will pop it right here. Alright. I feel like I need to... Alright, go ahead, Jake. Do your thing. I just want to trade a few things. Hey, Slick. Oh. Hope you ain't one of them sins. You gotta spy on me. Generally, doing a quick, fast travel kind of fixes it when the AI bugs out. Jake? I want to trade a few things. Hey. Hang on. God damn it. You guys are wondering, I'm swapping over to here. There we go. Hey, 
a municipal clock. You can think of it as a settlement's utility service. So it could be something like a power station or a water pump. Only more advanced than what you'd normally see in the wastes. Oh, didn't mean to do that. And I just realized my health has been a little low for a while, so. we go all right we're done that's everything but before we go wrapping things up i gotta mention that these municipal plots seem a lot more versatile than the other types rob co released some of the building plans seem like they could construct things for governance or even logistical facilities oh shit although we'll probably have to get the com hub running right to make use of the real good stuff but still pretty nifty huh what sort of good stuff are we talking about? Things like provisioning, communication centers, pretty much anything associated with, you know, government type stuff. Hmm. If you could picture a bunch of stuffed shirts sitting around big tables with papers everywhere, well, you're probably on the right track. But like I said, some of that stuff will have to come later down the line. However, there is at least one building plan we could use right now. Tell me more. <laughs> Just try and stop me. Now, one of the plots we just tested was the commercial. And commerce means cabs. So it might be a good time to talk about taxes. Okay, let's hear it. Now, everyone loves cabs. And who can blame them, right? And a settlement needs them just as much as anything else. Now, okay. I know it may seem boring or even greedy, but taxes really are important. Our settlements are growing. And it's going to take cabs to keep generators humming. Gasoline ain't exactly growing out the dirt. As always, you did great work. Thanks to you, the people of the Commonwealth can look forward to things being just that little bit better now. Glad it turned out well. <laughs> you and me both. Well, speaking on behalf of those living in the Commonwealth, I gotta say thank you. All these new types of ASAMs, it's a little overwhelming to think what we could do with them. Glad you're happy, Paul. If you could tell others what you saw here, spread the word around, that'll be a big help. You can count on old Paul. I'll get right on it. So, tell me, Slick, how does it feel to have every plot type at your disposal? Bit overwhelming. You're now free to build pretty much whatever you like. As long as it's not too far away. I'm excited, I guess. Once the comm hub's actually running, we should be able to build the new plots anywhere. Hmm, say. Now that we've got all these ASAMs placed, I wonder if we could get some real-time communication working. You know, two-way radio. Mm. I'm gonna head back to the hardware store. I wanna look into this. Swing on by when you're free. I'll have something to show you. Sure thing. I'll catch you later, Slick. Alright, uh, see ya. Ooh. Out here, you gotta take things one day at a time. Jake at the hardware store where there's smoke. All right, back to Concord. Yep. Seems like every goddamn time. Oh 
Oh shit. Got him. Oh shit. Okay, you're up. Guess they aren't gonna need that anymore. Nope. Jake? to acid for overdrive. Catch a quick nap. There he is. I was going to say, hopefully that'll trigger Jake to reappear. <clears throat> timing. I was just about to try and establishing a radio connection with the ASAM. Anything I can do to help out? Oh, sure. An extra set of hands will be useful. You remember when we patched in the receiver module, right? Well, I'm about to try something similar using the comm hub's transmitter and a frequency amplifier. If those parts still work, we'll have real-time two-way communication between the hub and any ASAM sensor. Ooh. Sounds good. All right. I patched in the parts we need. But I think we're going to need more power for this. So I'm going to head down to Plutonium Well. Boost its output a little. Whilst I'm doing that, it'd be really helpful if you could try tuning in the hub for me. Sure, I can do that. Great. Just sit yourself down at the vault hub. Keep turning the frequency knob until you get a clear signal. Then just sit back and wait for my return. Okay, won't be long. Okay. All right, got to operate myself, operate the radio. Right. Oh. Oh, we got something. Command, this is Golf Romeo One Niner requesting additional support. Over. I hear you. What the? Well, who is this? How'd you get on this frequency? You're disrupting gunner communications. Do you know what kind of trouble that can get you in? You better tell me how you're doing this, and fast! Oh, damn. We better watch our step here. Sorry. Didn't mean to interrupt. Too late for apologies. Civilian gear ain't able to broadcast on this frequency. What kind of hardware are you using? Where are you broadcasting from? I'm not telling you that. Either you tell us now, or we'll just track you down. Don't make this harder than it has to be. You deaf? I said no, asshole. Given the strength of your signal, you can't be far. Once we're done with our op, shouldn't take too long to find you. Don't go anywhere. 
This is a big overhaul mod by the name of Sim Settlements. Bring it on. Slick! I got back as fast as I could. What did I do now? It's not you, it's who you're talking to. I overheard the whole thing on my pit boy. The hub's uh. broadcast frequency. It must be similar to the one the gunners use. Or at least close enough to cause disruption. Yeah, this is a massive overhaul mod. This is not good. We really don't want the gunner's attention on us. We definitely don't want them sniffing around the comm hub. This is not good. Whatever it is, we can handle it. I'm sure you've already had a few encounters with the gunners. Yep. They're definitely one of the most dangerous groups out there. If they can find a reason to mess with you, they'll do it. By broadcasting on their comm frequency, we've probably piqued their curiosity. They'll want to know what kind of tech we're using. They may even try and take it. I don't think we can afford to let the gunners come here. Maybe we can reason with them. That's worth a try. Maybe I could talk to them. Convince them to leave us alone. Hold on. I think I could find where they're radioing from. All right. Looks like they were somewhere northeast of Olivia. Well, guess I should go check it out. Try finding these gunners and see if I could reason with them. Although, kind of nervous. I'm used to dealing with raiders and your typical wasteland critters. But gunners, they're different. Yeah, I picked up on that. They're organized. Don't worry. I've got your back. You'll help? Thanks. I feel better already. Time to read Let me build the brothel so you can redirect some gunner aggression. The gunners were somewhere near one of those markers. <laughs> I don't know which one for sure. We'll have to check each of them. All Just right. so they're firing a different type of gun. Let's see if we can talk these gunners into leaving us alone. Hey, go ahead. Sure. Here's my supplies. All right. Let's give you. What was I going to give him? Honestly, yeah, use use the Tesla rifle. Alright, check the map. So we'll go from ten pines. But how you been cooking? How has uh the Thunder Chef been? Where's the guy that we're munching on? Oh. My lurks and bugs. Thank you. I work like just enough chill at home and play games. The rest of it makes sense. What's uh, your current... Uh... No sign of gunners here. It must be somewhere else. What's your current... Uh, well, not obsession, but like what's got your attention? Because I remember, 
uh, you're you're big into like sim games. Like I'm not sure like how heavy sim you go. But, like oh god, what were you playing last time you dropped? Like you were able to drop by a few times. I think it was Snow Runner or something. Oh. My God, I know this place. I gave him a Sam's. What the hell happened here? That's close enough. Who are you? Whoa, easy there, easy. We're not looking for trouble. Why don't you just put that gun down and? We could talk. Why are you here? We're just looking for some gunners. That's all. Gunners? You with the gunners? Whoa, now I said we're not looking for trouble. Snake, little help here? Look, all I need is for you to put down the gun. Then we can talk this through. Mine goes down when his goes down. Okay, that's fair. See? Putting it away. All right. Assuming you're not gunners, why were you looking for them? We were hoping to discuss something with them. Huh. Well, I doubt you'll get much of a response, but if you want to strike up a conversation, go ahead. I believe that one was the leader. Uh, speaking of... The new Diablo 4 season just came out, 14th of May, so I got about 200 hours into that. Yeah, I've played a lot of stuff. Fifteen hundred hours in Snowrunner. Jesus, I legitimately don't think aside from MMOs, I have fifteen hundred hours in any game. Speaking of season content of Diablo, I'm kind of done with, and Snowrunner released a new map just yesterday. Yeah, I haven't gotten into Diablo Four. It, it's on Game Pass, but uh, I don't know. ARPG just wasn't grabbing me at the time. What happened here? Yeah, I'd like to know that myself. If you don't mind us asking, what went down here? And who are you? Gunner expansion. They tried to seize this place. Locals resisted. Maybe even fought back. You can see the results for yourself. By the time I arrived, it was too late to help anyone. So I found a concealed position on the overpass and administered a little wasteland retribution. Sounds like justice to me. A bullet through the head is a quick death. Justice would have been slower. You still haven't told us who you are. No, I enjoy ARPGs. They just didn't grab me at that moment. Without sounding too melodramatic, I hunt down gunners. Been on this squad's trail for a week. This is the fourth settlement they've hit. I've played some sort of AP ARPG since Diablo 1. Did you ever play, a, what was it, Diablo? What was the resurrected one they did? Was that one or two? Bastards, all of them. Gunners have been unusually active lately, laying claim to territory all over the Commonwealth. The settlement was just the latest conquest. Saying that Diablo 2. Was it good? Decent? Shitty? Hut. I, no idea I know there was a bunch of chest. bitching about Warcraft 3 Sudden Reforged when it came out. A target. Sudden growth? Oh no. You didn't play it? Don't tell me the gun has attacked this place because I gave him a Sam's. What? The hell are you talking about? Well, you know, these little sensor things help people build stuff. I've been providing them with settlements for months now. Huh. Then this attack was your fault. Hey! Now you just wait a minute. You better watch what you say, mister. Calm down, both of you. Whether it was intentional or not, you made them a target. You can't blame me for what the gunners did! Folks deserve the opportunity to make a better life for themselves. And I don't appreciate some jumped-up vigilante accusing me of... Whoa, whoa, wait. You don't need to... Reinforcements. Hope you can fight. Yep. This was all mine. Oh, wait. I want to... Got him. Huh. Oh, nice. I was able to clip him. Damn it. Oh. 
Damn. I will talk to you in a second. But uh, there was a legendary one. I was going to say, I see him. Okay. Where was that legendary? Because I just want to see what they dropped. I'm nostalgic. I like to have a, from the past, like my new good graphics. I'm nostalgic about old games I used to play, but they are old. The seasons or new RPGs suit me very nicely. I go in fresh. Level up. There you are. It's a shotgun. I will talk to you in just a second. Give me that combat rifle. I'd rather have 32. Jeez. I kind of get my fill after power gaming for two to three weeks, and you do other stuff for a couple of months. Nice. Did you ever get into, uh, like, Crusader Kings or Europa Universalis or any of that stuff? Or did that, like, not your bag, generally? Uh, <clears throat> huh. Still alive. You handled yourselves well. Yeah, okay. well, felt the need to blow off a little steam after someone accused me of causing what happened here. Not gonna let that go, are you? Say what you like about them, but the gunners run a tight operation. Sooner or later, they'll figure out what happened here. Chances are you and your partner will be flagged as persons of interest. Oh, great. That's precisely the kind of thing we came here to avoid. You can expect more gunner attention from now on. So watch your backs. And they'll give you even more trouble than they give me. Can you tell me about your trouble with the gunners? Where would I even begin? We have history. That's all you need to know. Crusader Kings 2, it's from CK2. I don't have quite time and I'd get into new games like that, not solo at least. That's completely fair. So what are you going to do now? I'm leaving, and so should you. 
There's no guarantee more reinforcements. If a group of friends are into it, I could go the the distance. Yeah, whatever. Oh, and cut the charity with those sensors. They're just chum in the water. Yo, what the? What happened to his face? He's really gone. You're upset about something. I can tell. You heard what that guy said? That this was all my fault? You don't think he was right, do you? No. That given these people, A. Sam's made them a target? That I'm responsible for bringing the gunners here? You didn't know. It's not your fault. <sighs> Thanks. I could always count on you to lift my spirits. I'm just glad that Aiden fellow's gone. There's something about that guy that rubbed me the wrong way. Maybe it was the gun that he pointed at my head. And I'm not sure I trust his version of events regarding what went down here. Why don't you believe his story? I'm not sure. I guess I'm at that point in my life where didn't sit right. I choose to focus on what I really, really enjoy. When I was younger, I guess I was more willing to get into anything. Depends on what I have time to. And what I'm willing to spend that time on. Let's get out of here. Hey, um, I know this may seem odd, but I think I want to stay here for a while. Okay. We stop these gunners coming to Concord, but in doing so, we might have dug ourselves into an even deeper pit. I need to think things over. Maybe come up with a new plan of action for us. Or at the very least, reevaluate how we're doing things now. Whatever you decide to do, I've got your back. I won't be here long. Come find me at the hardware store later. And stay safe out there, alright? If anything happened to you, well, just stay safe. <laughs> Thanks. Okay. Is that another quest done? Hey. Okay. Oh. Uh, let's grab that. No point in leaving that for the scavengers. Indeed. Made me nervous, Preston. Let's check. Let's see. All right, where's Amos meant to be? Yeah, I'm also just thinking, like, what do I jump into after Fallout 4? I'd gladly lay down my life if it keeps humanity from repeating the apocalypse. And I'm just thinking, like, honestly, one of the big ones I'm thinking about jumping into is Armored Core. I know, and I know uh, there is quite a few people in, it, in the community who want to see me play Elden Ring. And here's the thing, I have nothing against, like, playing a new Souls-like. It's just, there would be, once, like, Shadow of the Earth Tree hits, there'd be no point in me trying to start streaming it. Because every, you know, Souls streamer worth their salt is going to be jumping into Shadow of the Earth Tree. Shut up. Aw. Ooh. Lots of shotgun shell. Aw. Aw.
What's wrong? You hurt? Nuka Cola. Interesting name. Or. All right, you can come with me. All right, where's old Paul at? Should be at the starlight. Yep. My other thinking is like, there's so many games to play, so many options. Elden Ring DLC will have so much exposure for sure. Everyone, their mom is waiting for that. Oh, absolutely. That's why, like, that's why I was honestly thinking about AC6. Like, I don't know how much of, you know. You catch it. The sun set is gorgeous out here. There's something about the way the ash hits the sky. It's got a dangerous look about you. You ain't here for me. Back already? How's the old boozer faring these days? And who's the little lady? Gracious, she looks in a bad way. I'm afraid it's bad news. I take it from your look, Amos wasn't as lucky as our friend here. <sighs> well, darn. It's okay, girl. Well, let's have a look at our little lady here. Easy there, little lady. Easy, girl. Gracious, what did they do to you? I know you've got other things to worry about. She's hurt pretty bad, but I can help her through this. Please, leave her with me. Before you go, though, if you happen to have or find some dog food or fresh meat, I know little Cola here would appreciate it. Uh, I think I have... Do I have some? Oh, damn it, I didn't even see what that said. I'm running low on food for little Cola. Could really use anything you have to spare. Sure. Here you go. Oh, much obliged, much obliged. This will do nicely. Say thank you, little cola. Orf, orf. Can't quite put my finger on it, but there's something about you. Come here. It's going to be okay. I'm petting a dog. What? Hi. Yeah? What can this old pile of bones do for you? Oh. The fuck? I was going to say, those sounded like fucking rifle shots. Heavy rifle shots. Foggy is a bitch right now. Is that a Boston Terrier? Is this a JoJo reference? Hello, uh -huh. them fair and square, Trudy. Ain't our fault if he's strung out. Now don't make me come in there and shoot up that little trading post of yours. Whoa, whoa. Easy there, Skip. This doesn't involve you. Oh, but it might. You stop waving that gun in my face, or it's gonna involve me. Okay, okay, just take it easy. That's what I thought. We'll lower our weapons, alright? Just don't do anything crazy. Now hand over your money. All of it. Just keep calm, all right? <laughs> That's everything I have. Now get the hell out of here, both of you. You gotta be kidding me. Fine. That's what I thought. We'll leave. Just my goddamn luck. <laughs> yeah. Fuck out of here. Or, uh, I give you a new little scar. Except this one's a bit more permanent. You know, fuck it. Oh, big You've got this. 
What's up? Can't believe you made that scumbag turn tail and run. Here, this is for you. Now you ever need to trade? My shop's open. Oh, I, I, yeah, he, he ran, yeah. You got things covered from here? Yeah, it's gonna take my son a while to get off the chems, but we'll make it. We always do. Now let's get back to business. You need anything for the road? Let's see what you've got. All salvaged, but nothing's junk. Ooh. General Chow's Revenge. <laughs> All right. What do you got? Okay, I was going to say, what do you got for ammo? Honestly, yeah. Uh, combat rifle, maybe. That okay? It fires forty-five. Uh, would you like? Sure. Sure, let me check on the kid. Never take a hit of jab again, I swear. Excuse me. He changes itching all over. Okay. You go. Shut up. I'm looting these fuckers. I, I took all their money and then I just <sighs> dropped one square between their eyes. No, I don't feel bad at all. Okay. Reach the field camp. We could do the glowing sea. Well, I need to lie down for a bit. I ate about the entire week's worth of a poor family in one sitting. Oh, damn. Well, I'm gonna save here. And I am actually going to call the stream for today. Take it easy, everybody. Thank you all for dropping by. It's always appreciated.